Now to a defender's update tonight on an SAPD officer who shot and killed an unarmed man. We now have copies of the civil service file of Officer John Lee. And as we're about to show you, those records paint a mostly positive picture of Lee from people both within and outside of the police department. Since 2010, the annual evaluations of Officer John Lee show he meets department expectations. There was one year that stands out in Lee's file, 2011. That year, Lee's evaluation reflects that he exceeded expectations in several aspects. The report states Lee is always professional when dealing with the community and demonstrates a vast amount of knowledge with all laws related to his job. On February 4th, Lee shot and killed Antoine Scott in the parking lot of a Northside apartment complex. Lee told investigators he thought Scott was holding a gun. Scott was actually holding a cell phone. Lee was trying to arrest Scott on felony warrants when the shooting happened. Lee's civil service file also contains four notices of merit written between 2004 and 2011, commending Lee for good police tactics, judgment, communication, and teamwork, and for his initiative and investigative instincts. There are also positive letters written by community members who crossed paths with Officer Lee, one of them highlighting his professional and courteous manner. Following the shooting, Police Chief William McManus took steps to potentially place Lee on indefinite suspension. Then last week, the chief announced Lee would not face disciplinary action, but would instead be retrained. But the fallout over that possible indefinite suspension continues. The San Antonio Police Officers Association is currently taking a vote of no confidence in Chief McManus. The voting period for union members ends on Wednesday.